The Forgotten Front Porch. Ew. <laughs> Everything's dead. It's still, it is, let's see, tomorrow is October 1st. And we are living in a desert. It is so hot. <clears throat> it is today, the high is 98. Mm -hmm. I mean, my porch is pathetic. Looks like even cats do. But she's not. <laughs> she's laying on the <clears throat> dead fern leaves that fell off the ferns that used to sit in these plant holders. Yes, it is a sad, sad front porch. So, we are fixing to get it together. Are you ready to rumble? <laughs> yeah, I'm losing it. It's this heat. It'll get to anybody. Anybody. Look at my yard. Look at my dead flowers. Everything's just dead. We haven't had rain in uh, two months. <clears throat> and it's been 98 degrees and above. Just wonderful. So, anyway, I'm going to put this porch back into shape. Stay tuned and I'll show you the final product. I finally got the after. It took me a few days, but I got it all cleaned off and decorated for fall. And the reason I'm going all out here is we're having a big party. So, anyway. <laughs> uh, that's why it looks so decorated. Mom told me that it looked like... Um, fall had thrown up at my house. So anyway, this is the result of the throw up and um, this is what it looks like. <laughs> It's fall time, so that means it's time to use those porches. Sit out on them, enjoy them, drink your coffee on them in the morning, and just enjoy the heck out of this fall weather. So I'm going to give you a little tour of my porches decorated for fall.
I got this idea from a friend. Um, she said her daughter was looking for a frame to go around her letter. And I had a letter, but I didn't have anything to go on the frame. So now, voila. I thought, what a great idea. And I love it. I love it. Thank you, Mimi. Thank you, Megan.